So recently somebody asked me, how can I get varied height or varied distances when I extrude a curve, like, you know, like a spiral curve like this. First, we start by creating the curve. For this, I just use a labs spiral curve, a very nice node. And then I create some uh, normals, have the normals pointing upwards so that we can use this attribute to extrude our curve. All right, copy about 10 of them. Create a distance scale attribute using the attribute randomized, and it's a primitive attribute. We're having a random distribution of values between 0 0.4 and 1. Then we use an attribute promote to promote this value from a primitive to a point, and it's unique for each curve. And then after the attribute promote, it is now a point and it is the same for every point on each curve, but varied for each curve, just the same. Now the magic happens within the poly extrude soft. So now we can use a distance scale attribute that we created upstream here in the distance scale under the local control tab of the poly extrude soft. So all these parameters under the local control tab allows us to use attributes to control parameters inside the poly extrude soft itself. So for this one, all we need is a distance scale. And once we turn that on and do our poly extrude, you can see we have varied heights. So if we turn it off, everything is the same height, turn it on, we have the varied height from the parameter and we can use the poly, the second poly extrude just to uh, extrude it out this way along the normals. And don't forget to subscribe and like this video.